Hey guys, what is up? SuperMindPod here, and welcome back to episode 4 of Cube Worlds. Um, so this is where we left last episode. Um, we were going to the city to the inn because night was starting, and even though you have the flashlight, you don't see quite a lot with it, and it's very annoying to kill monsters at night time. Let's see if that one is friendly or not. Okay, that one is. Um, so we are heading to the city, I would believe it was that direction. Yeah, I'm alright. Alright, and we uh, got last episode this mold, which is of course really cool. And I love him. And we just leveled up, so probably we could, um, improve our skills. Well, not probably, it is so. We could do that. Let's get that cotton. Oh, you still, I... If, if some of you guys know what you can do with the cotton, uh, cotton capsules, then let me know. Uh, let's get them. Oh, those are quite good, actually. Didn't have thought of that. I thought it was a chicken, you know, it's easy to kill, like in Minecraft. Okay, there we go. That one was slightly easier. Easier for us. So let's go. All the time I want like to open up my hang fly hang light it because I have that on another uh, character and it's just the whole time I want to do that. The whole freaking time. And also let's see if we can uh, get ourselves some better weapons because I want to have like not this power one thing you know power one sucks so yeah there should be an inn around here you know let's just turn get in front of uh, let's zoom in there that one should be one I believe if you can find the door. Where's its door? There it is. Oh, tables in the way. Oh yeah, I would like that the game sometimes is gonna act like when you enter it, you see now a wall so you can't see anything inside and to zoom in. I am um, pretty much like if you didn't go like in these blocks when you walk in. That's sometimes annoying. But well, that's what I think that's annoying. I personally think that. Um, let's see if we need to sell something at this shop. Okay, we can sell those. Um, something special. Chocolate donut for a mole. We already have a mole as you can see over there. Level 2. Hmm. Good, isn't it? Um, I always send these things. I always do. But these for making a uh, mushroom soup or whatever it was. I don't know what you you could make some sort of food with it. Uh, but you need to level up quite some levels in order to uh, get that. Uh, and that's for rogue. We don't have a lot of different things. Okay. Um, we probably will need lost flasks because we don't have any potions left. So let's get about, yeah, 20. That's right. Um, now let's head to the weapon shop. To the weapon shop. Door on this side? Yeah, there it is. Okay, let's see. We are power 10. A used wooden staff. We could buy it. That's the best thing about it. Let's get that one. Oops, I sold it again. <laughs> yeah, you get the same. Not that it is uh, a different place. So, now I attached it. 
Okay, this one has, of course, more damage because it's obviously more damage because it's more power. Or I didn't check it actually, but you know, see, these are four together. It's eight, and this one is nine point seven damage, which is good, of course. Um, let's go to that purple training center for the mage over there because we want to improve our skills um, first of all you don't need to do that over here but when you're going to change something you most of the time need to so let's learn that okay um so let's go ahead and find some mobs to kill and I've here some delicious some delicious cup of coffee next to me so Gonna drink that very quick. Alright. I'm good to go. Let's uh... Hopefully we find some mobs. Or actually maybe... We're gonna cut something in until I find a already one. Um, turned out last video pretty well. Only one thing that was pretty uh, weird. Um, that I want to tell you. Um, in the beginning of the video, the intro and the first couple seconds of the actual gameplay, um, that was not really um, going well. YouTube didn't upload it well, uh, then I deleted it and uploaded it again. And then it was still like all pixelated on the beginning, very crappy, and then I deleted it again, uploaded it, and it was still the same. I took a look at the file that I have on my computer, there it's just alright, I rendered it good, but YouTube didn't really um, do everything well, and some, some, some mages they fight now, I hear them. Um, so YouTube didn't do it well, or it could probably also be in my uh, internet connection, because the last couple days I've had pretty much trouble with it. I, I just loaded a page, it loaded, and I click a link, you go to another page, and then it was disconnected. When I refresh, I go to the website. So, um, yeah, that was quite annoying. Um, so, I, I didn't really upload any videos because I thought, you know, I want to have good content. So, um,. Yeah, and if the quality is going to go very bad because of that connection, then um, then it's really sad, you know. I always want to have good quality videos, not only how they look, but also uh, the content within it. So we're not only let us 10 GP or anything different, But it also needs to be like have some quality in it, some entertainment or whatever, or some good tutorial. So yeah, I didn't upload. But right now I've got fixed everything, or <laughs> it, it looks everything works perfect again. Now for one whole day nothing is going on. But they also working here in the Netherlands, like on a lot of places. They're gonna do um. Uh, glass fly fiber uh, cables within the ground for internet so everyone gets that so probably maybe they have been working on that I don't know um, there's a lot of that progress cutting going on here in the Netherlands like people were saying like we don't want that we don't want that and I think like it's it's genius if you have that you know gaming goes for so much better and such and you don't have more of those leggy people, you know, in um, games and online matches, which is of course really cool and, you know, there is nothing downside of it. Maybe, yeah, it costs some money, but that's probably everything. Um, so, yeah, maybe they have been working on that, I have no idea. I have no idea at all. Come on! Die! You need to die. Don't kill me. You need to die. Let's get that copper out. Oh, there's another mole. Let's 
stunned. What's that? Gloves. Let's uh, wear them because it could be these. Um, hands. There we go. Oh, that looks a lot more better. <laughs> a lot more better. Flies. Flies. Okay, we we actually I'm now thinking like I need to fill my uh, glass flasks with water, of course. So I'm gonna do that right now. I'm not gonna record it because that is a little bit boring, I guess. So um, hello, let's do that. All right, guys, I have filled twenty glass flasks with water, of course. Um, so we could make potions if we can't find another campfire. And there are alpacas! I love them! And I love to kill them. <laughs> those look always very cute. But those are not too hard to kill, and... You get like... 2 XP from it, so... A uh, 1. Okay, I thought they would give you more. I believe some give you 2. Let's get those plane runners. Where's my mole? There it is. Because I need it in the fight. How many XP gave two only? That one gives a lot more. But I'm gonna kill if I try to kill that one. I'm pretty sure. If I can barely kill these. Then I can obviously not kill that one. What's out there? In, I believe in that direction was like that giant crow that we tried it to defeat last episode. Um, that didn't work because there were like frogmans or yeah, frogmans I believe or lizardmans. I'm not sure. And the when dad's walking in that direction, so it didn't really go well. Everyone was like following me. If the crow only was there, then it just, you know, wasn't a problem at all. Um, but now it was. Um, actually, I have right now an idea to go from the different side towards it for a sub like that. And let's get that one first. Okay, there we go. Just one XP! I wanna have more XP, bro! It's not funny at all. Let's get those bunnies back there. Like, usually I always have when I'm playing, like, it's like, sometimes ages before you find any mobs to kill, but now I find them very easily, so probably I will not cut a lot of this in this video, a lot of, uh, content. Probably not, just like a couple cuts and then I'm done. That's of course always a little bit better. You know, I can spend time on like doing other things than just uh, cutting things out. Ah, it's going always annoying if a monster is within the water. Or I think that's a little bit more annoying. Than it usually is. It's back in there when you're on that. So we pause them now. There are some lizard mans or gnolls or. I don't know. Oh! <laughs> this is just the land of the giants. For the most. And when I was at a new video, I saw that the. Oh, hold on, is there a frogman? There is a freaking frogman! Okay, okay, okay. I'm not gonna survive this. I'm totally not going to survive this. And my mole died too. I pretty much needed to make the potions first. Maybe that was a little better idea. Let's go to that lake over there. And don't kill them. Don't kill those bitters. 
Let's see if... Oh, there's my mole. There's a big fight going in. Hopefully those are friendly. Yes, they could support me now. They could help me defeating a crab. And they are going to revive me. Which is, of course, really cool with all those water mages that are... They left a lot of stuff over here, bro. Come on, help me! It's, it's not the worst thing to defeat, but it would be nice if they helped me a little bit. Would have been nice. Are those gonna attack them? Then I'm gonna help, bro. So to get some little bit of XP, which I didn't got. Okay. But those are really cool, those pitters. I have one as my pet and they can heal you. You know, pets that have a real purpose other than killing the enemy. Pets that like revive you and then heal you. That are awesome pets, you know. Let's see. Friendly, you're friendly, you're friendly. Okay. Now we don't need to be scared anymore. I can sleep for a little bit more health and let's make some of the potions. I'm not gonna make all of them. Obviously not. I'm gonna get again a little bit of coffee. Alright guys, now we have ten potions. And there has been a fight going on. They are drinking potions as well, and I pick up all the stuff that they <laughs> that they left there. Why are you not taking that stuff, bro? I don't know if it was even useful for me. Um, no, that was like a rogue and a ranger, and there's nothing for a rogue and a ranger. So yeah, probably they left it there because they don't need to. Have it, or they never pick it up. Okay, so somewhere in this lake should be an boss, which I can try to kill, but I'm not gonna make it. Oh, those are all friendly. That's really cool, actually. Guys, don't forget, these lakes are very dangerous. There are a lot of spitters in it, crabs in it, and of course, an end boss. Which is very big, but I couldn't find it. And you could dodge on the water, of course, why not? Let's see if we could find the end boss. I've been swimming a little bit, but I haven't found it yet. Let's help them so we get some more XP. Oops. Let's get that. I don't see a boss or anything to kill. Is there at least one? Maybe it's like off the, on the other side of that rock over there or so. You're gonna get killed. So Alright. Hey Surreal Bar. I have already gotten that bar once. But I kinda of forgot what uh What mark we could get with it? I'm not sure, but I believe it was a camel that you could get with it. No, don't follow me. I'm just like helping him a little bit out so I can get some XP. Yeah, let's attack him, bro. Oh, 
One more attack. Oh, he already died. Okay. Where are we gonna go? A cat. Some crows back there. Oh, that? Is that the place where the giant crows were? Oh, no, those were over there, I believe. Anyways, let's get that direction over there. This out. I wanna get that out. Because it just gives 1 XP or so. Let's get that owl. And some leftovers. Plus 14. Awesome. Those. I'm not gonna kill those yet. Those are dangerous mobs. Skullball. A skullball. However you pronounce it. Let's kill and get both of these. Now I have having to do like a lot of things because he was already damaged quite a lot, so that's awesome if you see some someone else attacking something and then he dies or she. And then you take over their animal and you just kill it. Get the XP of it. Well you didn't do really a lot. Let's see. Some armor and yeah, that was it. Um but I think I'm gonna stop this fourth episode of my cube world let's play right about here. Uh, we've done quite some lot of things. We've killed a lot of mobs, quite some, <laughs> um, with our mole together, of course. Thank our mole too. Um, so this wraps up episode four. If you enjoyed it, then please hit that like button below the video and subscribe to my channel to join the mining army and check out all of my awesome videos here on YouTube. Um, also, please do like my Facebook page. A link to that is in the description below. Um, so that wraps it up. Also, share this video on Twitter and follow me everywhere else and all that good stuff. So everyone, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and have a nice day. Bye!